Hey fur friends, welcome to Furry Friend Zone. Today we're going to do a review on the Equa Groomer, which is a de-shedding tool. So stay tuned. So the Equa Groomer um, comes in two different sizes. This one's the smaller of the two. It's made of, the handle's like a wood. It's, you can see where it's chipped. And then the actual blade is plastic. And you can just see the jagged little edge on it. So th this is a de-shedding tool that I've been using for about a year. Uh, we did another video reviewing the, the Furminator, which is also a de-shedding tool. And then we did a review comparing the two. So um, we'll, link those, we'll link those below above. or above. <laughs> and, um, cost. and a cost for the Equa Groomer, they started about, I think when I bought it last year, it was less, but like everything else in the world, everything's gone up. So I think it's starting at about $25 and goes up from there depending on the size. Canadian. And that's Canadian as well. So I will show you on Fred, Fred being a medium, well, he, he's a short haired double coated dog, but his coat, I wouldn't say it's as short as, um, here buddy, he's kind of like a lab coat. He's a mix between a Roddy and a Mastiff that we know of. So I'm going to just run this through his coat and show you. Now this tool I like because it's not as abrasive on their coat because it's not, it's not um, metal. So you can't damage things like you can with, I find, the Furminator can do. So as you can see, it's taking out a ton of hair, but it's not taking out too much, if that makes sense. I really, really like this tool. And you can also use this, you can bath your dog and do it while the dog is wet, and then dry the dog, and then do it some more, because after you've bathed your dog, a double coated dog, bathing them will loosen the undercoat, and then brushing them is a lot easier. Like right now, he hasn't been bathed. I'm just showing you this on a on a regular coat, which is more than likely how you'd be you'd be brushing him or your her at home. Just I would just do it in the backyard and run this through their coat. Good boy, Freddie. Um, and it, it will it will definitely help with de shedding and all the hair that's falling out in your in your house. Does that feel good, Freddie? Oh, it feels so good. Freddy falls asleep. Yeah, see, it's coming out very, very nicely. And it, you just take the fir the sorry, not the firminator, the Equa Groomer, and you just run it with the grain of the coat, and it will take out all the dead coat that's underneath. And you shouldn't like be be aware of just like with other de shedding tools that you're not running it over in the same place over and over and over. So just disperse evenly when you're when you're running it through the coat, and then you won't there won't be any damage done. But he's getting like I'm getting a ton out here. You're being such an angel. <laughs> So now we're going to do our furry friend zone score. I'm going to do durability first. Durability on this one, I'm going to give it a 7.5. Uh, because of that score, I'll explain why. Handle being wooden, it's thick, so it's not going to break. But if if my furminator, a dog got a hold of the handle and chewed the end of it, if a dog got a hold of this and chewed it, it would be destroyed. And also because this blade is plastic it doesn't have the durability that the metal ones would have but saying that if you drop this one this one um, wouldn't probably break whereas if you drop the the other one being metal if this was metal it, w it could very well chip and then when you're using a chipped metal blade on a dog you can cut them so it's pretty much garbage then so I would give this one just because it's plastic and wood I would give it a seven and a half next will be cost this one range uh, starts at $24.99. I'm going to say that, that I'm going to give it an 8 for cost because it, it's very effective and it, for the cost, it's a decent price. 
you can't, the only issue with it is it's not as accessible as the other de-shedding tools. Like you can't, I don't think you'd be able to get this one in a pet store. It's actually for horses. It's called a horse grooming tool. And you, so you can get it at like Green Hawk, for example. I haven't actually tried this on my horses, but I need to because horses shed like crazy. And there's so many different shedding tools out there for horses, but I feel like because it works so well on dogs, a horse has a very similar coat to Fred. So it's if you have horses and dogs, then you've got a two and one. So that, that score for cost is an eight. Third score is effectiveness. I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10 for effectiveness. I love the way this one works because I don't feel as concerned if someone at home that's not a professional groomer using this on their dog could do as much damage. So I would I suggest if you're doing this at home and on a dry coat, and you're just, you're, you're using it on, you know, with caution as well, but it does get a lot of undercoat out, and I feel that for someone at home, it's a great, it's a great tool. So nine out of 10 for, for effectiveness. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>